Okay, everybody, listen. I just wanted to uh, leave a quick video response to this uh, because a lot of people seem to be under the impression that I paid for that tattoo when I was, in fact, homeless and without money, when that is, in fact, not the case. I was sitting at uh, McDonald's, uh, practically living there, when uh, one day uh, let's, uh, a friend of mine, uh, a tattoo artist friend of mine, wanted to uh, get some practicing done. He'd been out of the tattoo game for a while. And I was kind of homeless and everything, and I liked tattoos. And he was like, listen, uh, come on over. Uh, let me go ahead and practice on you, and um, we can talk about you maybe staying around for a little while, you know, uh, getting a shower, having a place to sleep, stuff like that. So I was kind of, you know, all, well, I was like, well, you know, what do I get? And I guess my uh, mental state at the time um, chose that. So, uh, what I went over there, uh, he drew it up real quick, I, I it took about 45 minutes to get the tattoo, it was really painful. Um, I stuck around for a few days, and, or a week or so, and then I left for a week or so, and then I found myself back there. And I ended up living with those guys for about three months. Uh, I got a, a kind of a short-term horrible relationship uh, you know lots of sex kind of uh, girlfriend out of it um, that that turned out to be a very poor relationship and, and turned out really badly but um, that that that's pretty survivalist if you ask me you know letting letting somebody mark up your skin so you have a place to stay for a little while but uh, again, uh, I did not pay one single penny for this tattoo, other than um, I, I did uh, I did um, buy food for the house via food stamps while I was there. But you know, that's I need to eat, so uh, you know, I didn't mind buying a little food as long as they were doing the same thing, and that's that's pretty much how it worked out. But. Other than that, I was living there pretty much rent free due to this this ink on my chest. So, I just want to make that clear right now. I'm, I'm kind of tired of the whole you know tough love comments about it. Uh, I'm going to remove those if they continue showing up on the video. Um, yeah, let's let's kind of move on past the whole thing. Uh, let me show it to you. Uh, I'm a little hairy. Uh, it's actually kind of. Uh, it's in, it was done in India ink, so it's actually kind of faded semi badly. I'm gonna use this as the base, and then uh, have have an artist go over it with some better quality ink. Um, yeah, it's a little a little more stout, uh, but I, I think there's a good base in there to work with. Anyway, uh, this video is really longer than I wanted it to be, so there we go. See ya.